Place value means that the position of a digit in the number shows its value. If we look at the number 524, we can see that the digit 5 is in the hundreds place, which means it has a value of 5 lots of 100, 500. The digit 2 is in the tens place, which means it has a value of 2 lots of 10, 20. And the digit 4 is in the ones place, which means it has a value of 4 lots of 1. 4. To support your child to understand place value, it's important to help them understand that we have a base 10 number system. This means that our number system uses 10 digits to create all numbers. Those digits are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Place value gives the value to those digits. So the 9 in 29 means 9 ones, whereas the 9 in 9642 means 9 thousands. Grouping in tens will help your child understand this. Let's take these straws. I can count out nine of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I can put a nine in the ones column. But when I count 10 of them, I group them into one group of 10. And put a one in the tens column and a zero in the ones column. Counting money provides a great opportunity to help your child to understand place value. You could begin just using 1p and 10p coins and encourage your child to group in tens to find the value. Okay, Amelia, can you help me count all of this money? Yeah. Yeah? How do you think we're going to count this money? Probably doing tens. Doing it in tens, that sounds good to me. So can you help me count these pennies? One, two, three. That's great, so that's one lot of ten. How many are left? Let's see. One, two, three, eight, nine, ten. Ten. So how much have we got in total here? Ten, ten and ten is, is twenty. Twenty, yeah. Okay, now we've got all of these ones left. So let's do some more counting in tens. A hundred, that's good. And we've still got some more, so let's do some more counting. Ten, twenty, nine, ten, one hundred. One hundred. And we've still got more. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eight. 90, 100. 100. Where we've got 10 lots of 10p, that's the same as 100 pence. Mm -hmm. And 100 pence is the same as? 1 pound. 1 pound. So we've got 1 pound. Mm -hmm. And then we've got another lot. A pound. Another pound. And then we've got another pound. And how many have we got here? 10 and 10. 10 and 10. So all together, we've got... 20. We've got... Um, how many pounds have we got? One, one two, three. Three pounds. Three pounds. And... Two, 20. Yeah, three pounds and 20 pence. Make opportunities to talk with your child about place value as you go about your day. Point out numbers in the environment, such as numbers on signs, house numbers, measurements in a recipe, etc. Ask your child to read the numbers and then to say how many hundreds, tens or ones are in the number. 
Ask your child to compare numbers by asking which number is bigger or smaller and encourage them to explain why. Talking about numbers will help your child to build familiarity with number and deepen their understanding. 